Hello ladies and gentlemen, Magnadox here for another episode of Dark Souls. Now, I know in the last episode, and I'm very sorry that the two episodes got cut off, because the last episode was really supposed to be 29, but 26 and 27, they got corrupted and I couldn't upload them. So, uh, really sorry about that, and I think I lay in the description of episode 20. Seven that I did upload, I told you a little bit about what happened. I killed the discharge demon. Uh, I got what I got a ring. Ooh, almost jumped off the edge. If you can't tell by my lack of knowing what buttons to press, I haven't played this game in a little and a little bit, and also I've been playing Skyrim. So it was B to open the in inventory in Skyrim. So now I'm starting to dodge roll when I'm trying to look at what I got. Yeah, I got the fire ring one, which I actually don't need anymore. Quit. Oops, whoops. And I need to get. Rippers is no sound. Extra sorcery. Poise. Critical. Item discovery. Um, absorb HP from fallen enemies. Maximum equipment load. Let's go. Steel protection. Boosts defense and attacks. That sounds like a decent one to use. Because I'm rolling good enough. But. Along my journeys of being lost, I noticed that you can... Oh, oh if I would have fallen off this roof, I would have been mad. But so, I noticed that there's a broken window over here. Now then, don't... I, I didn't... How should I put this? I knew there was a broken window I was supposed to go through. I've seen people walking through the broken windows on different things, like Let's Plays and all that. But I didn't... Oh gosh didn't know where the window actually was so I had to and I didn't know when I was actually supposed to go through it and it wasn't until after I killed the discharge demon and made the last episode that I realized wait a minute there's a window somewhere in an Orlando that you're supposed to get to and that's the one you I mean that's how you continue <laughs> So eventually I did come back to an Orlando and I looked all around and then eventually saw the broken window from over there where the gargoyle was. And that's where we find ourselves today. We find ourselves in this new castle with these weird ninjas that are very squishy so they're not too difficult. Is that an item over there? Oh, there's an item on the bell. Or the, the bell. Oh my gosh, I I know. Chandelier, jeez. <laughs> I was like, things that hang from the ceiling. Well, I know the bells, great big bells hang from the ceiling, like the ones that I rang, but what else could possibly be it? So, apparently there's an item on the chandelier I'm supposed to get, which I, oh, I just have to hit the chain, and then go down. Who's shadow? Oh, it's his shadow. Nope. 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 Please don't kill me. Why can't you just fall off the edge? Doesn't matter. <laughs> I do enough damage to you where even if you heal that much, I'm still gonna one shot you, dude. Yeah, this that oh. Okay. That works. Um so now I have to do a great balancing act on these beams and eventually not eventually get to the downstairs area. Ooh, a new job ninja dude. Throwing that great, I mean it's useless. <laughs> Fire bombs would be useful right now, but not throwing that is. Can you fall off the edge please? Like look, I'm over here. Just walk in a straight line towards me like most AI pathing. No, okay, hold up. I guess I shouldn't have been taunting. I guess that's on me. On me for talking noise. Oh gosh, I'm gonna go all the way back and go back across the tightrope walk with the ninjas. Or whatever they are. They look kinda like ninjas. They have the robes and everything. But I guess I'll see you guys when I get there. 
because it's a it's not really long, but it's a treacherous walk that I might die again on. So I'll come back when I get back to where I was. Okay. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I recovered my souls, and this time I was able to stay alive and not fall off the edge, although I got very close. Ooh, it's there's two dark knights next to her. Um, I'm not sure who that is. I'm sure the game's mentioned her before, but I don't remember. Or who she's supposed to be, at least. I mean, that could be anybody. Anyone in the game that's named but not shown. Is this how I get down? Yes, it is. I'm guessing this isn't a boss battle. It's not. Everything. What? Oh, you want to backstab me, huh? Get over here, punk. You know, backstabbing only works if you do enough damage to actually kill. It does help that I'm. It's taking me so long to get here. I'm probably severely um, over leveled and for this area. I mean, I am, I think, level 53. Which... What? Where am I supposed to... Is there some... hidden thing around here? I mean, it's the hallway to a dead end. Is it expecting me to drop down? Because that would kill me. Oh, there's a little ledge right here. Or, can I go, can I get here from the outside using the new path I just opened up? Because that would make a lot more sense and would be a lot safer and, well, better for me in every way. Because then I wouldn't have to, crap, because then I wouldn't have to risk my life. Hello, what the heck is... Oh, it's another gargoyle. He's trying to run after me even though he can't reach me. What if I do that? Can you get me now? Nope. Oh well, he's probably going to be able to get me after I activate this. Okay, so let's continue on with this rather than staring at the running gargoyle. Oh yeah, now the running gargoyle can get me. Very easily. Yep, there he is. Alright, let's do this. I killed your friend, so you shouldn't be too much trouble. Just, you gotta land, though. It's kind of unfair. I thought we were gonna fight this, fight this out like men. Can I drop on you? Ooh, I did it. Ouch. Okay, camera angles are not helping me on this fight. Okay, that was uh, very anticlimactic. So now what? So that's how I get back into the... This is, hang on, this doesn't help me at all. How do I get to the ground? On that building? Or is that... No, that's not connected to that building. Wait a minute. How am I supposed to get the item? Oh. Okay. Oh, just a. <laughs> I have to walk down these stairs. Oh. I have to go down this giant contraption that I just moved. That makes a lot of sense. I don't see why I was so interested on where it was supposed to go. Okay, so I don't I don't know where I was going with that last thought. That one just trailed off into nowhere. I just spitting out words as fast as I could. Okay. Oh crap, now there's a ton of them. Oh hello. Did 
This is just fantastic. Let me tell you how much I love this game. Don't get hit. Roll dodge. Roll dodge. I was. You could hear me slamming the button. Okay, here's the plan. I'm gonna run away. Our. They call it a tech. Tactical retreat where I'm from. And as long as I don't face my back to them, they can't do terrible amounts of damage. Unless I do that. Guys aren't so bad, I say, as I get wrecked. Yeah, let's heal up, alright? We'll, then we'll sell this like men. One, one mono y mono, no friends. What'd I say? Gosh, I. These guys are terrible when they're fighting 20 of them at a time. Come on, open, open yourself up, let me. Worth it. Dwindle down. You know what? Oh, you missed. You're so terrible. Okay. The dolly drop is throwing knives. All right. You just dodge and weave you. There. See, was that so hard? Was that so terrible? <laughs> All I had to do was single them out and fight them one on one. Which is basically the strategy for every time you get grouped enemies in this game. Single them out, fight them one on one. Um Yes yeah, what I thought. Oh, I I did not follow my rule. This sorcery does not help me, I'm not a magician. I'm fighting like twenty of them. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Ooh. Oh. Dang. How'd that feel? Oh boy, let's go. I already killed. But you're spinning nonsense. Yeah, we get it. You can roll. You're every Dark Souls online player. Come on. <laughs> Painted Guardian. Oh, they're called Painted Guardians. Is that a mask or is that hair? Or is that... Hang on. I thought they were just wearing hoods. Looks kind of like hair. Come on, turn over so I can get a good look at you. Oh, this guy. I already turned over this guy, didn't I? But I can't, I can't really see his face. I can't really get a good look at him. It looks like a hood with a metal ring as a mask, I guess. Oh, who's this guy? Is this the single-handed painted warrior that can just kill me in one shot? Or is he just a random bystander alone? Random bystander alone that had stood no chance. Ooh, black iron. Two have not heavy class, or else I'd be able to use that. Jeez, I have 20,000 souls. What am I going to do with all these? I can only level up once. Yeah, because it takes like 17,000 for me to level up. So I can level up once, fight Ornstein, and oh gosh, Smo? Yeah, Ornstein and Smo. Or Smog. Or Smaug. However you want to pronounce it. It's really up in the air. Because I don't know. Just go climb this long flight of stairs back here where the cargo was to, you guessed it, another flight of stairs. Man, don't you just love this architecture? It's great. They don't See, this is why they always show those things are moving. Oh, those are the gargoyle things that took me here. 
be wary of death. It's not very inviting, dear buddy. Do I have to fight these things now? Or can I ignore them? I mean, you helped me out. Why would you kill me now? Oh. These guys always try to kill me. So, no big surprise there. You missed. Can we not aggro the other guy, please? For once? Come on. Okay, let's think about this. Well, according to most hand, or not hand to hand, but most melee fighting techniques, oh crap, when fighting multiple enemies, you want to line them up and make it to where only one can attack you at a time. That way it reduces the chance of the second guy hitting you. And if this game can... <laughs> if this game works anything like actual melee fighting, this technique will work. However, it never mentioned giant sentinels in any fighting guide. So, I think I'm going to have to wing this one. Ouch. Oh crap, I'm out of Estus. Oh, this is not good. This is not looking good for me. There better be a bonfire close by. If not just one of them, I should be able to deal with him. Easily. Shield smash and get killed. All right, can I enter the giant door now? Locked by some contraption, of course it is. Why is it that you can never walk up to a giant door in a game and have it just be open? Why can you not just sometimes catch a break? Oh well. I have to go back to the bonfire and heal myself up because I'm not only near death, but also completely out of Estus flasks. But I will do that off camera because we are all out of time for this episode. So thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button if you liked the video. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I'll see you guys next time.